I'm not a dancer, I'm a sculptor. I'm interested in what things do and how they make us feel. I love working with Larby because he he's also very interested in, in a way, using, you could say, catalysts. This is just a catalyst. Using a catalyst for interrogating how the body might move through time and, and space. All of the work that I've done before with Larby, in a sense, has used uh, either surrogate representative bodies or space frames or boxes that related to architecture. And this is the first time that, in a way, the structures have been liberated from that kind of reference. I like the idea that we're in some sense is making a sculpture in time that we don't know what its real shape is and that every every time it's performed maybe it'll have a slightly different quality. Can we give the dancers instruments that maybe allow them to extend their bodies into space or think about structuring space itself um, with the same materials? I think that, that the dancers really have to understand the geometry uh, and that's why I've asked them each to make one of these balls. That's good. Look, they all ought to be they all ought to be like that. The difficulty is often with this process not discovering things that you can do but but finding the in a way the connective tissue that doesn't seem like it's just a jumble of you know playing around put into a sequence. I think there's a hope that we will arrive at some kind of understanding about, you could say, the relationship of the body to space more generally.